In a recent incident that has sparked widespread debate on the proposed Uniform Civil Code UCC, in India, a video capturing a Muslim bus conductor being forced to remove his skull cap by a Hindu passenger has gone viral on social media. The incident, which took place in Karnataka, has drawn attention to the potential impact of the UCC on the religious practices of Indian Muslims. The video shows her confronting the bus conductor about his skull cap, questioning whether it is part of his uniform. In response, the conductor respectfully explains that he has been wearing the skull cap for many years without any objections. However, the woman insists that he must remove it, arguing that religious practices should be kept confined to one's home and not brought into public spaces. This incident highlights the broader discussion surrounding the UCC. Incidents like the one in Karnataka further fuel these concerns and underscore the potential challenges the community that follows Islam may face under a uniform civil code. The hate atmosphere is strategically cultivated by the Modi government, might not be possible to eliminate. This incident reflects Modi's vision for India, where hatred against Islam is systematically encouraged. This hate campaign has gained momentum over the years, reaching new levels of intensity. India's democracy is not in a healthy state. From young children to elderly Hindus, Muslims are derogatorily referred to as termites and terrorists. Hindutva supporters openly advocate for the removal of Muslims from India. The recent incident of the female passenger objecting to a Muslim's identity exemplifies how hate is infiltrating the minds of common Hindus. None of this is spontaneous. The poisonous rhetoric is taking its toll. Modi presents himself as an indispensable global leader, sought after by Western leaders to counter China and challenge Russia. He has never been more empowered in his Hindu nationalist career. It is unconscionable that the international community remains silent in the face of these events.